Hello everyone and welcome to Jurassic World The Game. So you guys have been requesting this for ages now and thankfully I finally have a device, my little phone, that we are able to play it on and oh my gosh, is this like a tsunami? Or tsunami? What? Monsoon? Oh my gosh. What is in there? That's kind of small. Is there like a dinosaur in there? Because that's kind of small for a dinosaur if you ask me. Oh my goodness, are we just like jumping right into the thick of it? So I have never watched or played Jurassic World the game. I did see the movie. The movie was okay. I, I kind of liked it. I could have been a little more scientifically accurate with some feathers, but I won't be that picky. Oh, look at this guy. Tell me I'm not in like the pen with him, please. So I have no idea what happens. We used to play Jurassic uh, Builder for a long time. Oh my gosh, are we like in a fight right now? We played Jurassic Builder for a very long time. Okay. This arena, you're you sure your girl has what it takes? And apparently this version, Jurassic World, is going to be a lot more fight-based, if you ask me. Oh, hey, I know that guy. Don't listen to Hodgkins. Just focus on your triceratops. <laughs> triceratops. Charge the attack. Oh my gosh, I'm like tripping over my words because everything is just happening so fast. Okay, so apparently we're attacking. Are we like in the pin with them? Oh my gosh. All right, I'm, I dubbed the Tracy the second. Tracy, please defend us because I think we're all going to be lunch if you like don't win this. Man, look at that. Oh, wow. These guys look so good. Not good. We can't take another hit like that. Oh my goodness. But now we've got two action points this turn. Oh my goodness. Okay. Um, so, all right. So I guess that two out of two are action points. We're going to block and then we're going to attack. I wonder what the yellow one does. All right. Now we're going to take out this guy. Oh my gosh. Maji. I'm just going to call him Majungosaurus. Maj Majungosaurus. I'm assuming that's what its name is. I'm going to butcher the names again, guys. I'm so sorry. But we're diving back into the world of dinos. Let's see what's going on. All right, that's enough. We'll analyze the data we have so far and come back later. Well, thank goodness. Jeez, you guys. Throw my poor... Apparently, this is my Triceratops and just throwing it into battle like that. Wow. Okay, so we are here in Jurassic World. We oh wow, look at this. Is this where is this my place? Am I in charge of this? Is that my Triceratops? Is that Tracy the second? We played Jurassic uh, Park Builder for quite a long time until like glitches just started piling up and I really enjoyed it. And now we're gonna dive in. Oh, we're gonna pay our dinosaur a visit. Hello! And we're gonna see what we can do here in Jurassic Park world the game so i have never seen it played before i've never played it i've never had a chance to even look at it so this is going to be pretty entertaining for me and possibly very frustrating for you guys as we get used to the amazing new world we're in so apparently i'm going to dive in and check out my triceratops now we're going to beef up that trike of yours all right oh wow look at you oh man it looks so good okay so we're going to be feeding it all right now it's up to level nine where are you going? Are you chewing? Oh my gosh, so they'll go over. Look at her chew on her little fern. Poor thing. I'm sorry that they threw you into like... Uh, okay, okay, okay. I, I have to keep feeding you. But I'm sorry that they threw you into a big old pen with a big old nasty thing trying to eat you. Right on. But that ain't the only way to get a stronger dinosaur. Follow me to the creation lab. Alright, so apparently we're going for really strong dinos. I'm assuming it's the end of the world and the only way we can save ourselves is by fighting dinosaurs against each other. Because that's the only way that makes any sense. Alright, I am the chief geneticist, Dr. Wu. I hear you're looking to genetically modify one of your assets. I can help you with that. With two identical assets ready for evolution, we can combine them to, to significantly enhance the strength of this triceratops. Alright, so- oh, look at them! Did they just stick my entire Triceratops in these two vats? Because that's- that's- oh, wow, those must be huge vats. Alright, so I go ahead and I use the genetic points. Oh, and I think we evolved it. So I think I used two level 10 Triceratops, made a level 11 with a little star. We're gonna see the results. The evolution is successful! Yes! Alright, so let's collect that. Hey there! Tracy, you look different now! You are leveled up and you got your little star. All right. Now that we have an enhanced strike, we'll head back to the arena. What? Okay. I'm sorry, Tracy. I'm assuming this is the only way to like save ourselves. It's some sort of horrible apocalyptic future where we viciously fight dinosaurs from prehistory. Oh my goodness. All right. So we're fighting again. Back for more, huh? You're sure you sure are a glutton for punishment. I've got an idea. Charge the reserve. It'll come in handy next turn. All right. So then I assume we're saving our action points that way. 
Player two is apparently using two attack. Why did they get two attack? And I only had one action point this round. All right, it's our turn. Oh, okay, and now we have three out of two points. Tapping on the reserve saves our action points. Now we've got a bigger advantage. Hit it with everything you've got. All right, strike, 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 strike. Go for it, Tracy the second. All right, I wish I could just give you like a quiet life full of ferns, but wow. Wow, okay. So she kind of took him out. Wow, so we're keeping busy, you guys. We're definitely keeping busy. Huh, what a surprise. You can teach an old beast new tricks. Yeah, you won fair and square. Just don't let it go to your head. All right. I knew you could do it. Name's Odin Grady, by the way. You're going to do just fine here in Jurassic World. Well, it's kind of like a dino to eat dino world. It's very vicious, but... Whoa, all right. So now we have unlocked a common Manjun Gosaurus. Oh, I'm just going to call him the Magis. All right. We're going to go ahead and hatch it. All right, so if I waited three minutes, then he'll hatch, but I guess I gotta speed it up. Collect. I wanna see, <gasps> look at all of them. Oh man, I love this lab. I wish I had a bunch of floating dinos in my lab. Man, that makes me wanna build it in zoo crafting. That is so freaking cool. All right, let's go ahead and place him down. I guess I can't really affect where he moves. All right, and we gained some experience, and there's a lady here. We've been monitoring your progress, and you show potential. Claire Deering, I'll be here to help you manage the park. Let's get down to business. All right, so she's helping us with operations. Help Claire produce some food for the facility, okay? All right, so I guess, why don't we just like, there's a bunch of ferns over here, that's what Tracy eats. Can we just not use the jungle? Okay, so I think we need to activate the food harbor and collect the food. All right, done that. There we go doing good leveled up to level two and we've un oh wow look at that fountain that looks awesome we've unlocked battle stage two a new expansion the acu security office that looks pretty cool i really like the sleek designs on everything actually gives me lots of ideas oh what's this mystery pack all right what are we doing here okay we got some food we have some dna we have some money and we have a flying guy all right my little tropio oh my gosh guys i can't do it so i'm just gonna call him like mm, he's spoonbill this is spoonbill all right it's now available at the market so we can go and check him out let's go hatch him i freaking love this hatchery too can i like get out of here nope gotta speed it up man the hatchery ah oh, look at that that is just so awesome that looks so cool. There's so many dinos just floating around, ready to be hatched. Oh, it's so neat looking. All right, can I move you anywhere? Is it gonna let me move you? Nope, I just have to leave you there. All right, oh, look at his aviary. Whoa, apparently something is happening. I totally missed it, I have to click on this now. Oh, I get a free little mystery pack, okay. All right, and we open it up. Got some more food, got some more DNA, we've got some coins. Oh, we've got another one of the little Magi guys. All right, so hang on, dude. I want to check out my animals. Don't be so impatient. Look at you. Look at you guys. So apparently I have two of these guys now. I think I had two, two Triceratops, and they were both level 10. So we combined them and evolved them into a level 11 with a little star, which is pretty interesting. Look at you and your little aviary. Oh, cool. I can, like, dive in and actually check them out and see what they're doing. Oh, he has a little fan under him. Does that cool you off? Maybe give you a bit of a lift so you can fly around the place? Man, he's awesome! Can I feed you a little bit? You only get 49 coins every 6 hours. Look at him fly up there to eat! That is so cool! That is so cool. Alright, well we leveled him up a little bit. I'm not sure if I was supposed to or not, but oh man! Alright, hang on. It's gonna try to be... Woo! All right, sorry about that, guys. It was trying to like hook me up with all the fancy Google things, but I want to check out my other dinos. All right, Tracy the second, look at you, looking so good. Wow, she's looking really good. Look at that, man, she looks awesome. All right, then what do we have going on over here? You guys do not earn a lot of money, just for the record. But I guess that's because you're just a baby. You're just a baby. Oh, do you have your own little Jeep? He's got his own little flipped over Jeep as a toy in the background. I don't know if that's setting a very good precedent though. What about if I feed you? Where's the food come from? Oh, so the food like pops up out of the ground. 
That'd be a smart way to feed them. Instead of like opening the side gate, which would be a very dumb way to feed them because you're probably going to turn into their food. All right, so that's what my little dinos look like, which is pretty awesome. Now, what does this guy want? I'm up for another rematch. What do you say? So we need to complete battle stage two. All right, he wants a rematch in the arena. Well, um, I guess we could do that, but I kind of want to see. So if I want to evolve this guy, oh cool, so I can like hatch this little one. I'm going to wait three minutes and then he'll hatch and we can possibly, I think he goes in the same pen, maybe? I'll have to figure this out. I'm kind of putting stuff together pretty quickly though. All right, and what do the packs have? So you get a free pack like every six hours from the looks of it. And then you can buy like super rare packs, limited edition things. The pack idea is kind of cool. I hear that like they're totally gypped on prices. So you're not going to see me pecking away at these. Because for these prices, I could buy like most of the sim stuff, which I used to think was the most expensive thing. But we will enjoy it as much as we can. So, all right. So if we went to battle and we were going to enter the arena, should I level up some of you guys first? So if I went to level you up, say, so I'm working on hatching somebody, but I'm probably gonna need to level you up. So let's feed this guy quite a bit. I wanna have his strength up. Oh, that's more like it. Now he's starting to earn us some coins. Additional dino missing. You are missing an additional dinosaur at level 10 for evolution. Go to the market. Okay, so you do need two dinos. That's kind of creepy. It's like, we'll merge your twin and create an ultra dino. That would, that would kind of freak me out. But we've got him ready. And then can I like level you up a little bit, my dear? Oh yeah, look at you. Getting the good food. All of that delicious, absolutely wonderful furniture. Wonderful. All right, let's pop down here collect those we'll activate the harbor again and then let's go fight so let's go see if we can do this all right we're fighting this guy who looks pretty interesting so his health points 87 health points 33 attack points um let's go ahead and let's send out this guy and this guy wow you know what spoonbill actually has a lot of little um hp that way and so we can send out two at a time okay there was an interesting scan button that I missed, but we'll check that out next time. Alright, so it's our turn. I just want to attack. This is going to be my lead offensive guy. Let's see what we can pull off. Alright, I think they saved their point, so that could be kind of bad for us. Ooh, wow. Alright, let's try block and attack. Alright, can we do anything there? Oh, he blocked too? Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Like I said, first time ever even seeing this. It's really awesome though. Look at this one. Like ta -ta 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 -ta. That's right. You keep your little your little pecking away from me. And we're gonna try Attack. Oh I got you. So it's kinda like balancing out all of the blocks against each other. So did we get hit? Nope, we didn't get hit. Okay, good. And let's see, let's do block, attack, attack, attack. Come on, you can do it, buddy. You're level 10 now. All right, we got him there. I think they, he's gonna get us, though. Oh, wow, yeah, he's gonna get us. Sorry, dude. Maybe when you evolve. There you go, Tracy. All right, I kinda swept the floor for you, Tracy, so let's do this. All right, two blocks, two attacks, because I think she just needs to have one attack go through, and boom. You did it, Tracy! Though, again, why we live in such a horribly aggressive world, I'll never know, but, you know, you just gotta roll with it or you, you get eaten. I have a feeling if I question it too much, they just feed me to one of the T-Rexes. Alright, so we won and we got some DNA points. Sweet, and we unlocked that guy. Pretty cool. And we can hatch him. So, let's see. Uh, open incubator required. An unoccupied incubator is required for syncu uh, sequencing. Activate this incubator for 10 buckaroos. Uh, I don't know yet. I'm going to save my buckaroos. All right. Mission is complete. Sweet. So we finished that up. Somebody is ready to hatch. Let's go ahead and collect him. Oh, there you go, little buddy. There you go. We can place you down now. Okay, so then he goes into the same pen. So some of the mysteries are begun are beginning to be solved. All right, you guys. So this is a pretty good start, if you ask me. I'm starting to feel it out, figure out what's going on. Um, it looks like, can we expand? Yeah, so we're gonna go ahead and expand. And I'm gonna keep the food coming in, because food's very important. 
to leveling up our dinos and I'll try leveling up this little guy so I click on him there we go so it's starting to make some sense so you click on like the individuals and then you can feed them in their pens so I'll try to get him leveled up to level 10 so that we can get those guys evolved and we'll try to let's see let's get the other little guy let's go grab him hatch him and he'll be ready to hatch later too. So we are really working on expanding this park already. I'm enjoying myself so far. So this is gonna be pretty awesome. What's over here? Oh wow, what's this? The aquatic market with the Mosasaurus, which I hear cost 100 real US dollars. So we probably won't be seeing that guy for a while, but what do we have down here? I don't know about having like a, okay, I see the fencing now. I was like, I don't know about swimming next to the Mosasaurus. I don't know if I'd have the kahunas to do that, but if you guys would, then let me know, because that would be kind of amazing if you could just like swim on this little beach and be like, yeah, there's just a mosasaurus kept away by a fence right next to me. That would be kind of interesting. And then what's over here? So here's the little like helipad, and we've got like this little, okay, okay. I like the size of our island. All right, so this is our island. Looking pretty good. I like the edges of it. I like the sea. I like it. Ooh, ooh is this a volcano? All right, that's not concerning. Don't blow up on me, okay? It's pretty cool looking though. Ooh, ooh, what's this? Oh, cool, cool. Is this like the old section of Jurassic Park? Cause that's pretty neat. I, I actually would like renovate it. I want this to be my house. That's my house from now on. I'll have to trek through the jungle for miles just to get to work every day, but I think that would be pretty cool. But all right, you guys, I will see you next time when we will continue to try out the game, see what it has to offer, see if you guys are enjoying it, because it's been a while since we've had anything dinosaur-related. Oh, Tracy, you've already got some money for us. Yay! Yay, and the expansion's done. Woo! All right, we are on a roll. Look at that. But yeah, it's been a while since we've had anything dinosaur related, so we're going to try to fix that, not only with Jurassic World, but with some other amazing things coming up in the future. And I will see you guys then. Bye bye